schematic. See? So they so they do have them in, in there. That's actually pretty cool. Just must not be a really high chance. That was not in the game. Sounds like the cats are fighting again. That scares my cry. Ooh, handlebar schematic. Nice. Getting some good stuff, man. And all I'm trying to do is hunt a freaking chicken. <laughs> Thumbs! Oops, sorry. It's hard to do that with gloves on. As you guys should know... Oh, hey, welcome back! <laughs> As you guys should know, uh, I wear... Fingerless copper... Um, infused gloves. Because uh, my hands hurt when they're cold. And being as it's either always winter time here, or we always have the AC on, because it's summer, you know. It's pretty much the two seasons here in New York, winter and summer. There's really no in-between. But yeah, it's either... Yeah. So, you know, when my hands get cold, they hurt really bad. Come here, man. Come here, baby boy. Come on, buddy. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Welcome back, guys. I actually didn't have to go scare the crap out of a cat. See, um, Gizmo is Thumbs' son. And Thumbs, as strong and stocky as he is, he has a major handicap compared to the other cats. And I know this because I know a lot about cats. And I've watched like documentaries on leopards and crap. Um, Thumbs does not have a full length tail. Uh, his tail at the end is really knobby and it's got like three little kind of prongs that like are supposed to be the end, ends of separate tails. So he doesn't exactly have a full tail. So when he's fighting and stuff, he can't use his tail to control his, you know, movement and whatever else, as well as the other cats. And Gizmo and Tut both have a full tail. No, Gizmo. So no. they are a little bit more, they are quite a bit more agile than him, especially Tut. Tut is a very uh, lithe, lith, I think is the word. Okay, I And, uh... Gizmo is just about as stocky as man, but he's kind of long. Gizmo's kind of lanky, but he's also, like, he's he's heavy, and he, he's kind of a mixture between Tut and uh, Thumbs. But he has the full-length tail, unlike Thumbs. And like I said, that kind of puts Thumbs at a disadvantage. And the other day, they got into a really big fight, and Thumbs ended up with a pretty good cut on his head. And it was Gizmo that started the fight, and Gizmo that won the fight, and man, he tends not to fight when he's around me or Sin. He won't start a fight usually, but what Gizmo likes to do is he likes to get in man's way no. and not let man go anywhere. Um, so man will have to fight him to get by. And I don't like that. I don't like when the cats do that to each other. And they do it to try and prove, you know, who's big and bad or whatever. And to rebut that, I basically act like a big cat and growl at them and push them around like they do each other until they start backing off from each other. And Gizmo, the little turd, he um he never he never really when Man and Tut got that treatment, Gizmo wasn't really fighting anybody at that point. He was still little innocent Gizmo. 
And so now that everybody else has kind of calmed down and stopped being very aggressive, Gizmo has taken it upon himself to be the big aggressor. So Gizmo's really close to getting pushed around and growled at like everybody else has. Well, I mean, he's pushing mine really bad because he's starting to hurt man pretty good. Mm -hmm. And man really doesn't like to fight him. Man, he's actually become more playful because of Wesker, our new little kitty. He's uh, he's extremely playful. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I hate when it happens. Okay. I just go up the stairs and go to the next one. I don't know why it does that, but it, it does that sometimes. It's aggravating, though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so... When I paused, I was getting ready to go push Gizmo around because he was purposely walking super slow in front of Man when I had called Man into the room with me. So Man wouldn't fight him. But he was walking really slow to get on the box that Man had to walk by to get into the room. Just to be a jerk. Can you tell me what your pistol parts are? All of them? Sure. Oh wait, no, they're all blue, never mind. Yeah, one pink. Yeah, one purple. Um, I did end up spawning in a pistol and a magnum because they took them both from us. Um, I had a full magnum of all orange parts and it took it. And we had, Sin had a pistol of all blue and purple parts. And it took that as well at one point. So I spawned both those in. I don't care what you guys say. Yes, I understand it's cheating. Though I don't really care because, as I said, it took it. Yeah, I was really mad because I... We actually had had it. She had had the pistol for quite a while, too. Yeah. And it just disappeared out of her inventory one time, and it was really irritating, so... Yeah. That is why that got spawned. You guys can complain all you want. Oh, you're getting battle scars. You got pretty good, didn't you? It's because how cats fight, they like. The face. Well, they they try to go for the neck, and they use their feet, their hind feet, to kick their opponent's head in. Which, as many thumbs as man has, he should have a bunch of scars all over him. His face is also um, got the hair where it's you know been disturbed. Mm -hmm. Well, thumbs was looking like that the other day, so I don't feel sorry for him. Looking for beige Sit. parts that I can scrap. Sit. Yeah, I can't. I can't do anything with Magnum yet because I I don't have the ammo crafting Lay ability. Down. But you know. Lay down. Lay down. That's okay. I'll get it. Oh, look, we have ten gunpowder. Cool. Lay down. Relax. Still sucks that I can't build a hunting rifle. I, I, I can build a magnum, but I can't build a hunting rifle. I thought we found a hunting rifle. Well. We, we found a hunting rifle. And that is what um, Frozen Sorrow is holding, is the hunting rifle. They're using, he's, they're using it. Is he in the game? No, not right yeah. now. I do need to make more iron arrowheads. Um, what about all those arrows that are in the... Uh, I use bolts. Mm. But the bow doesn't have as much power as the crossbow. Crossbow's a little bit stronger. But I'm running low on iron arrows, so I'm going to switch to... Stone. Finish up these. See, look at all that. Look at all that. Bam. Good boy, I'll pet you. You're ready. 
Oh, okay. Oh, his skills. Oops. Hey, 272 minutes. That's more than enough. I'm sorry. That includes my anxiety pill. I'm trying not to. I'm sorry. Wow. I'm trying to keep my word about the cigarettes. Not working out well. Well, you've only got two left. So. Okay, I need to make 131. It takes 10, so I need to wait for... 130? I don't know, wait, does it take 10 or does it take 1? Oh, it takes 2! Okay, so I need to wait for 200 or something. 262? You only have one for tomorrow. I hope you do better tomorrow because I stream tomorrow. So, I'm going to kind of need you there. Switch that out for now. Get it to go faster. I'm uh, gonna make a bunch of iron arrowheads. Okay, so you're into it? I'm up top. Oh, up top. Yeah. I dropped off all the stuff I had. I need to make 131 iron arrowheads, so. Yeah. Oops. Something else popped up that I could make all of a sudden. That's funny. Did you pass the window? Yeah. And if I sit in here, I'm going to uh, get skill points for crafting, for uh, weapon, weapon smithing, I believe this goes to, which is really cool. Oh yeah, that's right, I need to make buckshot and, uh, well mainly just buckshot so I can make more uh, shotgun shit. Yeah, I know. I'm hoping to find one. Which, it's actually really lucky that I found bullet casings a lot, because, well... Exactly, I don't have the thing, the thing, see, weapon smithing is now level 32, because I'm just sitting in here crafting, um... I'm just sitting in here as it's crafting. If you actually sit in here, you get experience in doing it. It's actually pretty cool. So, if any of you watch Meaty, maybe tweet, him, tweet it and let him know, and say that you saw it here. Give me notice by senpai. Huh? Made a joke. I Said make, get me notice by senpai. You must be in a playful mood right now because he's not in here. Hey buddy. Come here. Come on. Come here man. Thumbs. Come here, buddy. Hey, 
They don't have the time right. That's funny. Think that the buckshot will actually give me weapon smithing skill as well. I'm sorry for the dinging in ears, you guys, but we're only 15 minutes in. Okay, and this is what I do up till nighttime, and then I just kind of sit up here on the roof and watch, look for zombies and stuff like that. It's actually 7:30. Huh. Probably gonna be going to bed soon. I got some stuff to do tomorrow. If I'm feeling up to it, I have a really long trip tomorrow. Which, if I'm feeling up to it, depends on whether or not it's snowing out or still snowed over. If it's still snowed over, I'm not gonna get to do it. No way. I'm just, I'm, I'm handicapped. Most of you guys should know by now about my, uh, my issue with my left knee. The fact that I dislocated it four times in a really short period of time. And, uh, yeah, it hurt. <clears throat> and if I'm trying to walk up the hill that I'm going to have to walk up tomorrow, then, uh, Having uh, a hurt knee is, yeah, it's a big skill, nice. Five points. Having a hurt knee will make that uh, practically impossible. Because this hill, the hill I'm talking about, most of you won't know about it. Some of you might, but it's the hill up to Herkimer College here. And this is actually a pretty ridiculous hill. And, uh, if it's covered in snow, it's going to make it a really hard climb. I, I mean, it, it's hard to walk on snow as it is. And, uh, walking to Walmart today actually really took a lot out of me. It was pretty exhausting. But I, it had to be done, and I was pretty much the only one that could do it. So, I did it. This thing's cool. Like, I haven't really found a use for it yet. I mean, I guess the wood frames would be, you know, you could do like a ton of wood frames or stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like I said, I think this is this is basically for if you want to make a ton of something, you know, you, you put it in here and then you can just like walk away and it'll craft it for you. Pretty cool. See how many zombies are in the area? Two? Zombie dog. And it must have spawned the other one a while ago. Oh look, I'm done crafting. There's a drop of water on my screen. Or monster. Might have been monster. But, uh... Starting to cool off, so I put on the jacket. <clears throat> that was an accident. I need to eat and drink. Did you mean to drop whatever you dropped? Yeah. Okay. 
Get eat this, get that wellness. Okay, that should have given me wellness. Twice. <coughs> mm, sorry guys. Ooh. Still do. Okay. Still do. That's all. All that paper is gonna disappear once I start making. Once I actually am able to make a ton of uh, gunpowder, which I should actually try and make. What the heck is all this stuff? Where's the gunpowder? Or coal? I still have it. Oh, coal. You can totally use it. Huh? Oh, I got some upstairs. I'll go upstairs and grab it. If this only makes 60, I'm actually going to be really, really upset. See, I have 120, and it only makes 60. Why? Why is it like that? That is so little gunpowder. Like, seriously. Yeah, but the coal and potassium nitrate, it's a two to one. You need two coal and two potassium nitrate to make one gunpowder. Gunsmithing level 31. Okay, I don't need it now. But yeah, uh, let's get in this episode, guys. I'm just going to make some shotgun shells here stock up on them. And, uh, be nice and ready for some zombies. Because I, I also have to kill, try and kill rabbits with, the shot, with my small shotgun, so, yeah. I believe that's one of the quests. But O is the quest? Yeah, O is the quest. It's pretty cool. Oh no, not man eater. Uh... Where'd it go? Um... Did I get rid of it? Oh no, that's not good. Um, I... Th I... Oh, I removed it. I'm such an idiot. That animal one. Oh well. All right, that's gonna uh, yeah, bit, but, 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 yeah. that's gonna end this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below and subscribe for more awesome content. Um, also, on my league videos coming soon, there's going to be a link for LOL King. So if you want to follow me when I'm follow my league stuff when I'm not playing when I'm not recording, you can uh, see it there. And. Once again, or I don't know, but anyways, you know, whatever. Once again, as always, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.